from the thumbnail I'm gonna be talking about pet stories so I have like four no three for this story or for this episode because I, my dogs well my pets don't really do anything like crazy crazy like unless you count pooping like sometimes in their cages I guess that counts but I have three stories that really stood out and are really funny so okay you ready I'm gonna get right into it Okay, first story is about my cat, which was the one that you saw on the thumbnail. And so she is kind of annoying with me. She'll like scratch at my door to come in, and then the moment I let her in, I close my door, she scratches to get out. And I'm like, make up your mind, please. I would appreciate that much. Thank you. But in this, so I was at my old apartment where I used to live, and you know, I'm like sleeping. It's like in the morning. And the day before we bought cookies and it had like a ribbon that held it together. I say no, I'm sleeping. And I hear Meow. I'm like, what the heck? Because I woke up for a bit. I'm like, I'm, just, I'm gonna go back to bed. Cause I do not want to have to deal with this. I don't know what it is. So good good night. I'm gonna go back to bed. And I wake up, I get out of bed, and my parents are like, Oh yeah, so the cat ate a ribbon and we had to pull it out of her butthole. <laughs> and <laughs> And I was like, oh yeah, I heard the meow. And that was when, like, the exact moment they pulled the, the ribbon out. This next story is actually pretty recent. It happened a few days ago. And so, you know, I'm walking into the kitchen. And so we have a little puppy. His name's Atticus. He was one of the photos there. He's a bit bigger now. But, you know, we didn't have any, like, recent photos of him. So I got a photo that was kind of there. And so... I get headlocked, thrown on the ground, I'm sitting there, and then all I hear is, Atticus, get her, get her, get her. So, this dog is like on top of me, messing with me, and I'm like, okay, it's fine. And then I hear, look her ear! <laughs> and all I feel is this dog's tongue in my ear, and I was literally ready to have like an aneurysm. I was just like, oh my god, this dog just stuck its tongue in my ear, what the heck, this feels so weird. He has a small little tongue, he's a cute little pepperino, and he has his best friend, which is China. Which is what the, the next story will be about. <laughs> so, I don't have any crazy stories about this dog. She's not like, she's nice. She's crazy and retarded sometimes. But, you know, there's nothing really, like, crazy. Well, one time she got stuck in my hair. But, Mel knows about that. But, this story is going to be about, I one time left a chicken sandwich on my couch. And she was out. And I went to the kitchen to like grab like a soda or something. I don't know, maybe like Pepsi. <laughs> and I was going to get it and I open it and I walk back and all I hear, <laughs> I'm like, oh no. And I see that half of my sandwich is gone. And it was like a chicken sandwich with mayonnaise. I love having my chicken sandwiches with mayonnaise, you know, bread. Cause I just love the flavor. And she ate half of it. <laughs> so I ate the other half because <laughs> I was desperate. I didn't want to make another sandwich. This one, the mayonnaise and the chicken and everything already soaked into the bread and it was good and I was waiting and I was like hyped for it. So like it wasn't that slobbery <laughs> so I just ate it because like why not? Yep. Thanks for watching everyone and I hope you enjoyed it. Peace. <laughs> I fall in love